Garrett, I can imagine this has been a, a whirlwind week for you trying to gather as much information as possible, but what were you feeling walking out of Dr. Elitrach's office upon receiving what he told you about your elbow? Yeah, I was feeling pretty good. Um, it was a good visit, and um, so feeling good. Can you describe the difference in emotions you may have had on a six-hour flight to L.A. compared to the six-hour flight back to Tampa? Yeah, it was, it was a little different. Um, I mean, you know, you're just sitting there trying to deal with a little bit of uncertainty, and then, you know, you get a better picture on the way home. Um, so uh, it was uh, – it's not something that I that I have you know had to do very often, um, but it's what a lot of guys have to go through all the time. So, so what are the next steps for you? Yeah, three to four weeks, no throw, rest and rehab, and go from there. Is it full no rest in that three to four week period? Yeah, we're gonna keep the arm live, um, keep it moving, keep it in shape, so that we can hit the ground running when we're ready. Can you at this point maybe pinpoint a timeline when you can be back on a mound? No. Soon, right? Yeah, I'm just trying to take it one step at a time. And throughout all this week, when you look at some of your teammates who may have some elbow issues in the past, how have they been able to guide you through this? Well, they've just been really supportive, um, offering, you know, some wisdom um, from their personal experiences, but mostly just encouragement and uh, just putting their arm around me. Glad to have the week behind you? Yes. <laughs> Kara, thanks for the time. Yes, thank you.